how can migrants pr protect themselves and what should they do if they have health concerns? Migrants can protect themselves if they are aware about the, the, the problem, uh, I mean, the, the, the dangers and the risk of HIV and how you, know, the, how you can uh, contract HIV. Uh, so in protection is very, uh, sorry, knowledge is very important in terms of protection. In addition to that, if you have the knowledge about how to protect yourself for HIV, then you can apply these methods. For instance, the use of condom, you know, when you are, we, it's, it's, um, it, it really saves lives if people protect themselves, particularly if they're engaging in um, sexual activity that, uh, that is otherwise, uh, you know, not sticking to one partner, for instance. If there are multiple sexual partners, then you have to really protect yourself. And um, of course, the most important thing is early diagnosis. So if you know that you are HIV positive, you can have your treatment and that will really help in terms of uh, giving the person a good quality uh, of life. At the same time, it has been proven that people who have been taking HIV early, uh, HIV ART, that is the antiretroviral treatment, early in the face of their disease, they have longer uh, lifespan. The problem with HIV is until now we haven't really found the right med the medicine that could really cure and remove the virus from our blood. There has been some studies and some very small uh, number of people that it has been totally eliminated. But still, in a majority of cases, in a big majority of cases, you cannot really say that you are fully treated. It can only uh, the, the, the medicines that we have right now can just help you uh, ensure that your immune system is there is good enough to protect your body from getting complications out of HIV. Thank you. Um, so uh, this has been our interview with Dr. Jamie Calderon. Uh, we continue to raise awareness regarding this issue and we encourage you all to know your status. Thank you. Thank you.